suppose if I want to create a line from this point if I want to define the angle on the upper side of x axis then you will have to take your cursor above and if you want to specify the angle on the lower side then you will have to take your cursor down suppose on upper side I want a line of 50 distance then to specify the angle you will have to press the tab button press the tab button for angle and give the angle so suppose I want to go in 30 degree then give here 30 press enter again suppose I want to go on the left side at first you will have to specify the angle then press the tab button when specifying your angle you always have to pay attention to this dotted arc that exactly shows the angle you have to specify that means right now if I want to go on this left side and I want to go 30 degree ahead of this 90 degree then I don't have to give the 30 degree if I give the 30 degree angle it line will come like this but if I want to go on this side with 30 degree ahead of this 90 degree then I will have to specify 120 degree then only this line will go on this side and when I could take the cursor down the angle automatically is measured from the bottom side then specify the length press the tab now here suppose from this 180 degree I want to come down by 30 degree that means I will have to specify this total angle of 180 minus 30 that is 150 degree and press enter then you can close from here I will just remove this object suppose I have this one line from this point to this point if you want to shift this xy on the left side then give the UCS icon command UCS icon enter and choose the no origin option it will always remain on the left side and it will not come inside your screen and suppose I have one more line here I want to create one line from this point to this point then take the line command and take your cursor near this point it will show endpoint this is called as object snap using this object snap you can create the drawing very accurately and from the point required by us in order to show this object snap you will have to keep this object snap mode on if this object snap mode is off then it will not show any object snap and from here by clicking on it you can make the object snap on then only it will show the object snaps then click on the point then make the ortho off then give this end point then suppose I want to create a line up to this midpoint when you take your cursor near the midpoint it will automatically show the midpoint object snap if in your case it is not showing the midpoint then you will have to turn it on click on this arrow here and select this midpoint object snap then it will show it automatically when you install AutoCAD first time this midpoint object snap is off by default so from here you will have to make it on then only it will show the midpoint object snap then select the midpoint again endpoint again endpoint then now it is again showing the midpoint but I don't want to connect the line to the midpoint but I want this line to be perpendicular to this line now it is showing the midpoint object snap but I need perpendicular object snap in such cases to select the object snap manually press shift button and right click and it will show the list of all the object snap from here you can select your desired object snap suppose I want it to be perpendicular click on this perpendicular then click on the line it will create the line perpendicular to that object then to stop the line command in between press enter it will stop the line command then if you want to create circles here is the circle command center radius keyboard shortcut for circle is C enter click here then he is asking for specify center point give the center point then give the radius it will create circle of that much radius again circle give the center point then give the radius enter as it has displayed endpoint midpoint object snap same way for circle it will show quadrant object snap automatically so you can create the drawing using the quadrant points it will show the quadrant object snap when you take your cursor to the center it will show the center object snap 
same way suppose I want to create line from this point now it is showing the quadrant object snap but I don't want to connect the line to the quadrant but I want my line to be tangent to this circle to choose the tangent object snap press shift right click and select the tangent object snap from here then click on the circle then press enter it will create line tangent to this circle and if you make any mistake and if you want to undo from here you can undo you can also undo by giving u enter or giving control z click on undo it will cancel the last command and if you want to cancel the undo and redo it from here you can redo it keyboard shortcut for redo is control y and you will have to do the redo immediately without doing any work otherwise it will not redo click on the redo it will bring back the object that you undone if you want to save this drawing click here on save then select the folder and give the name to the drawing and click on save if you want to close this drawing click here it will close the drawing and bring back you to the original interface now here recent documents are shown if you want to reopen this drawing by clicking here you can open it and if you want to open the older document by clicking on this open files you can choose the files that you want to open and click on open you can also start the new drawing by clicking on this plus sign it will start new drawing automatically that's all thanks for watching we will stop here